Hi everybody, here's the constellation litter. They were four weeks old yesterday. These are a KC registered standard poodle puppies. We have blacks and browns. The brown may fade to cafe au lait or silver beige. We'll know a little better um, after we've uh, clipped their faces and feet and see what they look like underneath. Okay, that one, let's see. The orchid collar one, that one is Hercules. The one next to him is Orion. Those are our two brown males. I just dewormed them, so that's what all the gagging is for. Okay, this one, this is our little girl, Cassiopeia, Cassie. She is super, super, super sweet. She loves attention. And she's playing with our third little brown boy. And let me stand up. Sorry about that. That's our third little boy. This is the run to the litter. This is Aries. Hi, Aries. Hi, baby. Sweetie, you still gagging? Who's this one? Who's this? Oh, that one is Hercules. Look at the little Superman curly he's got going on in there. This one's Gemini. There we have Cassie again. Sorry, my videos probably suck. This is Orion. And the big bruiser of the, of the bunch is Phoenix. He's going to be a monster. He is a big, big boy. Very masculine. He's the one laying down flat on his tummy. Oh, they're all just gagging over the... But, so, okay, they've been dewormed here at four weeks. There's proof. Gag, gag. <coughs> hey, that's enough. I swear. Somebody farts in the hood and they all go whack, whack. So this is their special outdoor place. This is a retriever kennel. We built it on a... Hey, that's enough, Tori. We built it on a um, plywood base, elevated deck. Um, okay, let's go inside. And then, so it came with the top, okay? We added four by eight sheets of plywood on all the sides on the outside. And then we hung six by eight tarps it's six foot tall so and we overlap to make sure that we didn't get water in then in here I have a soft crate and our swimming pool fits in it perfectly now they are not staying out here right now um, it's been too cold at night today is their first time to come outside we're going to litter box train them this is the bottom um, pan of one of our rabbit crates so I'm going to fill that with um, pine pellets and I'm going to train them to use a litter box. So when it's nice, I, I think they're really going to enjoy Tori. This, see, this is all, there's a, our gazebo thing collapsed. It's one of those gazebo things and we had the, we had the, top on it and the snow crushed it so this is just a, a shade sail that we put on it but that keeps that, that gives them some shade out there um oh mom wants to know what are they doing all right um so this is all safely fenced for them to be in here in our backyard um with access to shade sun they have a bed 
They have food and water out here, which they've almost eaten all their food. But they're loving this. They're just loving playing in this. What are you doing, Jim? So there you are, the constellation litter. Let me see if I can figure out who's who here. Okay, so those two, that's Cassie. The little one there is Aries. This one is Orion. This one is Hercules. Who is this? Oh, okay, so this one is Gemini. He is super, super sweet. Hi, baby. And the one in here, oh, you guys have already made one heck of a mess. Are you going pee pee? This one is um, Phoenix. He's the biggest of the litter. He's over five pounds now. He was 14 something when he was born. So the curliest one is the, the teeny little Aries. I think he's probably gonna be a small standard I'd be surprised if he was over 40 or 45 pounds grown, full grown. He may surprise us, but he has stayed small. He was the smallest, 10 ounces, um, when he was born. So, I don't know, we'll see, but... Yeah, these, so far these guys are loving it out here. Oh, look. We're just going to sit down and chill out. So, what would be nice is if they would just... Take a little nap. Um, Mom's not nursing them that much anymore. They've been on solid food now for about a week and a half. I started them on um, baby food at two and a half weeks. And now we've, we've graduated to um, puppy kibble, grain free. I'm using uh, four health grain free. So, if you want more information, these puppies are all still available. Again, the blacks may stay black or they may fade to blue, which is a dark um, gray. Anywhere from a dark gray to a, a dark silver. Or they could even fade to silver. We'll see. Um, Mom was dark brown like this when she was born. And she has... Um, she has faded to this. Savannah, you want to come in with your babies? You want to come in with your babies? Huh? You need your face trimmed, huh? That's a pretty girl. So if you want more information, you can, uh, we're on Facebook. Um, you can look at splitrocklamas.com and then look for the link on the home page for uh, Split Rock Poodles. Each one of these guys has their very own web page. Victoria! Holy cow. Um, and, uh, or you can email me, brenda.vance at splitrocklamas.com. Thanks for watching, guys.